Okay. We're back on. Um, I had a power glitch. Uh, unfortunately, nothing I can do about that. But uh, here we are. And we're going to start at the midpoint of the sinking since we were already halfway through when we got cut off. did it again. Let me switch back to free camera. Alright. Or can I? Yep, apologies for that. Uh, power glitch. Um, yeah. Unfortunately, nothing I can do about that. So I guess I can't do the free camera mode. When you start at the halfway point. I didn't, I'm not going to start the sinking all over again. Since we were over halfway done. So this will be just as interesting. See what it was like actually on board the ship. Okay, so yeah, we were we're not really uh, losing much time here. The forecastle decks already starting to flood again. what happens oh look at that we can swim So yeah, that boat we were looking at earlier with the prop got away. <laughs> Whoops. I wish there was a way you could like fast forward it. Yeah, I guess they don't want you uh, running into the props. Let's go check on the forecastle deck. The center prop spins counterclockwise to smooth turbulence in the water. That's good to know. Let's see. Can, yeah, we can go in the bridge. Let's see what it would have looked like in the bridge. 
Yeah, so there it is. Foxhole deck going underwater. I get the purpose of this they want you to uh or they at least want to give you an idea of what it would have been like on the ship and you have to try and escape but uh i rather the free camera mode so you can see everything going on around the ship Too hard to tell if the props are still moving from here. Sounds like they are. Yep, so the props are still going. So vast majority of the lifeboats are away at this point. Surprised it's he still got it moving at this point. I thought by this point he would have stopped the ship again. So we can actually get back on the ship right here. You notice we've got this really, really hard list now. And it progressively is just going to keep getting worse. The water's about to start coming on the forecastle deck here. Let's see how close we are. See, it's really, really close. And that's not me moving backwards. That's the ship moving forward still. I mean, he made a valiant effort to try and beach the ship, but it's just not meant to be. I mean, it's completely facing away from Kia now. I mean, at this point, even if the ship wasn't sinking with only uh, that port side uh, propeller going, the ship would just be doing 360s. deck railing just about fully submerged propellers are going to be slowing down again at some point
Yep, if anyone was in here earlier uh, and the stream suddenly cut out, it's because I, uh, I had a power glitch. Um, sorry about that. Uh, nothing I can do about it. Alright, so the ship is still moving forward. It's, it's the propellers are well over halfway out of the water I mean it's I can't believe he's still trying to move it at this point I, I am I admire him trying to do it though Let's take the fast way back onto the ship. Oh, it didn't work. There we go. So you see, there's still a lot of lifeboats left. Let's go down the B deck. Oh yeah, so the well deck is, that railing is now fully submerged. The forecastle deck is going under. Water's reaching over here on the port side. So I mean, at this point the ship is doomed. Once the bow's submerging, there's there's nothing he can do. Look at that. B-deck's about to go under. Mind you, the captain is still on the bridge at this point. He has not abandoned ship. See the ship's whistles. Those two long, really, really long toots uh, from the whistle, that was the signal to abandon ship. He's, he's given up. You know, there's nothing can be done. I think he, at this point, he just accepts it. Let's go see if uh, if the propellers have stopped. Yep, so there we go. Propellers are no longer moving. He knows this is it. This is the end. And see, even this late in the sinking, 
they're still launching lifeboats. And now it's, this is going to be the final plunge starting right here. Look at that. the the bridge is just about underwater now. Uh, correction, the bridge is now fully submerged. So yeah, this is the final plunge right here. Look how fast she's going down now. And one thing I've noticed that uh, the uh, the smokestacks are not breaking away from the ship like they did on the Titanic. Let me correct myself. There goes the third one. Now look how the ship is still tilting to starboard as it sinks. Uh, earlier in the stream, oh, there goes the second one. Earlier in the stream, before uh, the power glitch cut us off, I mentioned that this is 400 feet of water in the Aegean Sea, and the ship is 800 feet long. So when the bow makes impact with the sea floor, the stern is still out of water. Now, I don't know at what point that happens with the stern still out of water, like when the bow makes impact, but the bow makes impact and it digs in and then it starts bending the ship towards starboard and it makes a gigantic crack almost like a v crack uh might be the best way to describe it and then what you see the stern is just fully submerging from this point and the ship is resting at the bottom of the sea floor on its starboard side no uh, i cannot go underwater But if you go and look at pictures of the ship, uh, the wreck, you can see, let's get on this lifeboat here. You will see the ship resting on its side with a gigantic hole, uh, hole in the uh, right where the well deck would be on the port side. And there goes the fourth funnel. I think maybe by this point the uh, the bow has made impact with the seafloor. I'm not 100% certain though. So this ship took roughly 53 minutes to sink. The Titanic took two hours and 40 minutes to sink. And really, were they able to close those last two watertight doors had they been operable, this ship might not have sank. And this wreck is actually cons in considerably better shape than the Titanic. Oh, you heard that? That might be the bow 
hitting the sea floor. I don't know. It could be. And yeah, the Britannic is actually way pre better preserved than what the Titanic is. And for one, this ship did sink fully intact, unlike the Titanic. But when you look at it, uh, the pictures of it on the seafloor, you will see that big gaping hole uh, in the bow. And again, that's because of the uh, bow's impact with the seafloor. And there it is. There she goes. That's it. So if you're wondering how many people were lost in the sinking of this ship, uh, the answer is 30. Yeah, it is pretty cool music. All right. Let's see. Yep, so there it is. That's the uh, 
That's the HMHS Britannic and the game Britannic Patroness of the Mediterranean. Hope this stream was fun and enlightening. Sorry that it had to get uh, broken up into two parts because of a power glitch, but, you know, again, nothing I can do about that. So I think we're going to wrap it up right there uh, for all the people that stopped by. Uh, I thank you for stopping by. Appreciate it. Uh, there will be more Titanic related content in the future. It's, it's a topic that I'm extremely passionate about. Uh, and not just the Titanic, but other ships as well, uh, such as the Britannic here, the Olympic, uh, you know, Lusitania and others that I can't think of at the moment. But uh, so, yeah, this stream will be a two part stream uh, when it's available on YouTube. So. Um, hopefully you like what you saw and uh, that's going to wrap it up for tonight. Uh, I don't want any more. I don't want to stream anymore in case there's any more power glitches. I'm sure uh, everyone else is uh, facing extreme cold around the country. Um, we may not be facing it as much as other people are, but you know, for us, what we're facing is pretty extreme, and that's why I've had two power glitches this evening. So uh, that's the story behind the uh, why it's a two-parter. So thanks everyone who tuned in uh, again. hope it was fun. I hope it was uh, entertaining. hope it was educational and, uh, and stay tuned to the channel for updates on when I'll be streaming something else uh, like this because I, I do intend to do more of this. So uh, in the meantime, uh, Merry Christmas, happy holidays. Uh, you know, wish you, uh, wish you uh, joy and, whatever holiday you choose to celebrate and until the next time drive safely